Alright, so. Like I said, I haven't done uh, a lot of this in a while. So, this is going to be uh, trying to remember everything I'm supposed to do. And, uh, hopefully not screwing anything up. So, let's begin. Alright, so, got the motherboard. We're gonna install the processor, memory, SSD, uh, M.2 drives, SSD, cooler, and see how that is. Now, another downside to not doing this for a while. is uh, also a little nervous. <sighs> but, such is life, right? Another thing I forgot to check, I don't know if there's a bracket attached to the, a bottom bracket to this. Let's see. Uh, there it is. Let's see if it works. good for a while. Yeah, I know some people are like, that's a 9-9! Should have gone with the... What? Well, I got what I got. Like I said, you don't like these components, you don't like the way I put stuff together, that's fine. This isn't... Nothing on this channel is really necessarily going to be for instruction. It's more or less going to be documenting what I do, how I do it, and uh, any failures along the way. <laughs> and there uh, probably will be some. I know the camera angle is probably a little messed up, and I'm probably going to regret most of this when during editing. And of course, this is all taking me longer than I thought it would. But in that kind of how it goes, it takes you 30 minutes to do something, it takes you three hours when filming. At least that's what I've heard that way. Alright. Yeah, let's get going. Where is it? Best word of advice I can always give there is never cut towards yourself. I'll try to throw out a few helpful ones here and there, but most things I'm going to know, pretty much everybody knows. Pretty, shiny, shiny. Oh, I hope some people actually got that reference. Uh, always a big kid at heart. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm probably doing something wrong here. It made that fire up. something a little closer. See the indentations there? I see little indentations there. So, let's try that. Ah, oh, look at that. It worked. Ah, oh, I had it from there. That's not one. Huh. 
have a seat. Bit doesn't sound good. Okay. Some stuff's going to be edited out for sure. Or I may leave it in to just do it as a learning experience. God, that seems really tight. Guessing that's how it goes up. Okay. Let's hope nothing blows up. That would also suck. Fighters in there. Alright. Now. According to this, it needs to be... Memory needs to be on uh, A2 and B2. Which I already forgot which one. When in doubt, look at the manual. Don't try to do things without it. I say as after I just did something without looking at the manual. I know. Ironic. Uh, what do we got here? So from there to there, that is B2, B1, A2, A1. So I need A2 and B2. Alright. There we go. Make sure everything's lined up properly. I don't want to fuck anything up. I will definitely be editing that out. Or just bleep it. I'm not really sure. We'll see. Alright. 2400. Which, yeah, I know there's extra memory and all that. Two 8 gig sticks for free. Eventually, I will want to uh, max this out. Because that's my preference. Sounded a little crunchy. <sighs> All right, max capacity is uh, sixty-four gigabytes. Math hurts. Anyway, uh, I would need four sixteen gig sticks to max it out. Yeah, that's another thing. Math is not one of my strong suits, so. <laughs> Thanks, public education. And, uh... You don't see that in quite a few videos. <laughs> Let's get one going first. Technically, I think this is going to have been a multi-part, so... We'll see. What else do I need to put in right now? Double-checking, triple-checking... Making sure I don't mess anything up. Why am I whispering? <laughs> Not something I'm known for. Alright. Let's run. <laughs> Not run. Uh, again. Not one of my strong suits. Uh, okay. One thing I never really liked is all the different fittings. Like, I understand proprietary stuff, different things, but really, why do you need so many different fittings to take something apart, put something together? Just, I mean, Phillips, flathead, whatever, a socket, something, but keep the bits the same. Of course, then again, if all the fittings were the same, but it's like I fix it wouldn't exist. I remember correctly that's how they got their start. They uh, couldn't find a particular bit that they needed and upset that couldn't find it. And uh, so they made it. Then again, that's the entrepreneurial spirit, right? Something we should all strive for. I have no idea if that's how you're supposed to do this. I need to short something up. That would help. Okay. M.2 drive. Something that goes in my. Not like that. Mm -hmm. 
I remember correctly. Which is again kind of weird because I've never really dealt with these. Got to put them in a little bit and then push them down. That's supposed to be magnetic. I hope that stays. I hope so. If not, we'll find out. Alright. Anyway. Probably if I kept up with uh, technology, I'd understand why Optane was so important. But I don't. It's just, it's just, I think it's just another way to charge people more for something simple, but like I said, I'm not 100% sure. Alright, so, we have memory, processor, and M.2 drives installed. Well, let's go on to the cooler. I hope there's the whole in here. If not, yeah, it does have it. Nice. What do I know, right? Eh, maybe at some point I'll have an actual uh, workstation and whatnot. You know, I don't care who you are. I mean, honestly, I, I legitimately don't care. Uh, who, no matter who you are, that just looks nice. It's not all miscolored. I'm, I'm very much for the monochrome look. Yeah. And before anybody says anything, Again, makes comments and all that. Say what you want to say, uh, it don't matter to me. Most comments left in a video I will respond to. I'll try for the most part anyway. And, uh, is what it is. Alright. Let's go. go for the one that had two fans because it was fan, bins, fan, bins. I didn't want to put another fan on this side, which I've watched and read a few things that said that you don't get that much better performance. Uh, but when you're air cooling, more airflow. More airflow. Put that over there. Alright. instructions and uh, back plate bracketry all that so maybe you should have done that uh, before I installed the memory but still give it a go now 
make sure the holes are apparently aligned with the screws on the motherboard. Now, I'm going to be doing this more or less so I can see it. Uh, sorry for the bad camera. Don't scratch it. Don't mess it up. Wasn't too difficult. All right. I know. Most people don't look at the instructions while they film. There. We go. Okay. Apparently, no specific orientation. And if at some point you hear a cat meowing, it's probably my cat scratching at the door. Leaving me back. That's her little boxes in my bathroom. Anyone wondering? Her name's Aphrodite. Very lovable kitty. Very calm, very chill. Very different from the cats I used to have, which were very hyper. Tore stuff up. She's very chill. So, call her Aphrodite. You know, got us a lot. Very affectionate. Always wanting attention. Always wanting to snuggle. Very nice cat. No, nothing. All right. This side up. And curvy side out. So looks like. And of course, anytime you're tightening anything down, crisscross pattern. Careful not to over tighten. You don't want anything to crack. Crack is whack. Couldn't help it. Just fine. Alright. Alright, and for those of you who didn't realize what's going on, uh, she's a cat. In, she wants in, she wants out, she wants in, she wants out, she wants in, she wants out. Uh, you may see her occasionally in the background, you may hear her messing with the box, you may hear her meowing. Part of having pets is, well, dealing with them while you got to do other stuff. So, uh, what goes? Hi. So, got the bracket tree installed. Now I need the thumb of this. One thing I did realize is when I bought the iFixit kit, having those little spreaders to spread the thermal paste, because I do like the idea of spreading um, the thermal paste first instead of letting it just squish. Um, rather make sure I have complete coverage. 
but uh, I did not buy that, so I will have to uh, figure something out. That may be way too much. I honestly don't know. I know it needs to be a thin film. And uh, all that. So, I don't know. Of course, for you, that was literally just a blink of an eye. Um, can't stay out. Don't want to come back in. That later. Still debating on proper uh, proper amount of thermal paste. Really don't think that's enough. So I guess add more, wipe it off. Go from there. I'm not liking how little much is right here, so I'm just gonna put it too much. Now we uh dab it on there I guess. Spread it out. I had a spreader. That would be better. I know someone in the comments will tell me, oh my god, that's too much. Oh my god, that's not enough. Uh we'll see. I can always come back at another time and taste the cooler off. Pretty good. Alright. So, that's going to go over this way. Alright, let's give this a try. Hopefully, don't mess it all up. Because that was that. off here for a second. There we go. Alright. Let's tighten this down. Is that tightening down? I do believe so. Stand up for a second, reach over here. That seems tight up enough. the instructions again. Okay, so it says to tighten them until they stop, but don't use excessive force. I, I'm guessing that's... That's good. Um... back on. Fans. Not fans. In the little. This under here. There we go. Okay. So, as far as I can tell right now, 
motherboard is done. Now, I can try plugging in everything and testing it before I bound it into the case, but no, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to put it in the case, wire everything up, and uh, hope everything went well.